Hey everybody, how you doing? I found this article while checking out BoundingIntoComics.com. I highly recommend this website. You should always check it out if you want to check out all sorts of cool pop culture stuff. And go follow them at BoundingIntoComics on Twitter. I'm not sure if they have an Instagram, but I'm sure they probably have something like that. But anyway, let's go ahead and get right into this article, shall we? Star Wars fans petition for a continuation of Battlefront 2 storyline starring... Aiden Versio and Del Miko, and these uh, th these are the characters down here uh, from Star Wars Battlefront 2. A really pr a pretty decent game, if I do say so myself. It's got its problems, but you know I'm a Star Wars fan, so you know I let a lot of stuff slide. Let's go ahead and get into it. This is by written by this is written by John F. Trent, February 6, 2020. Star Wars fans have launched a petition for Disney to continue the Battlefront 2 storyline starring Aiden and Dell. The petition specifically is requesting a comic book series following Aiden after the events of the Battle of Jakku. The petition was created by Mason Carr on Change.org and is aimed at the Walt Disney Company, Marvel, Lucasfilm, and Electronic Arts. The petition begins... After the ending of Star Wars Battlefront 2's main campaign story and resurrection campaign as well, I was wondering what is going on with Aiden between the uh, between after the Battle of Jakku and The Force Awakens, and when was the birth of Zay? It continues. This petition is for Marvel Comics to make a comic book series all about Aiden Versio and Del Miko that focuses on their story between after the Battle of Jakku and The Force Awakens. I bet there could be Star Wars and Aiden fans wondering what was happening after Battle of Jakku and before Episode 7. And this is the picture of there. I've never actually played the campaign myself, but I heard really good things about the campaign. Let's go ahead and get uh, forward to it. If you want to know what happened, you can consider signing this petition. This could reveal the birth of Zay on what year she was born in and Aiden giving birth to her. How Dell went missing right before the Battlefront 2 main campaign ending, etc. And could also explore more of Shreve as well. And maybe could also use a great writer for the story as well for fans to enjoy. If you want Aiden's story to expand, consider signing. Especially if you're a Star Wars fan, obviously. Star Wars Battlefront 2's main campaign followed Aiden Versio, the commander of an elite Imperial unit called the Inferno Squad. Shortly after players are introduced to Versio, the battle for Endor. Uh, the battle for Endor, Endor. What the fuck? Star Wars Battlefront 2's main campaign followed Aiden Versio, the commander of an elite Imperial unit called the Inferno Squad. Shortly after players are introduced to Versio, the battle for Endor occurs and the Emperor is believed to be killed. However, he issues a final order to commence Operation Cinder. As part of Operation Cinder, Versio and her Inferno squad are deployed to Fondor in order to acquire satellites. After securing the satellites, Versio discovers that Operation Cinder will target her home planet of Vardos and has been ordered to be purged in order to send a message about the Empire's strength. Versio is sent to the planet to extricate Protectorate Gleb and him alone. However, she disobeys orders and begins rescuing refugees. She and Del, who is a part of the Inferno Squad, then send a distress signal to the Rebel Alliance and provide them information on Operation Cinder. Versio and Del are offered a choice to either flee or aid the Rebel Alliance against Operation Cinder. The two choose to aid the Alliance and join the fight at Naboo, the next target of Operation Cinder. Following the fight on Naboo, Versio and Del reconstitute Inferno Squad as part of the Rebel Alliance. They eventually decide to track down Versio's father, the Imperial in charge of Operation Cinder. She discovers he's based out of Bedspin and severely cripples Imperial forces by destroying a number of Star Destroyers despite her father escaping. They would then also ha participate in the Battle of Celeste as well as Jakku. In the skies above Jakku, Versio tracks down her father and attempts to get him to flee his burning star destroyer. He refuses, but Versio takes an escape pod and crash lands in the desert, where she is discovered by Del. Following the Battle of Jakku, there's a 30-year time jump that sees Kylo Ren capture and interrogate Del. 
who reveals that the map to Luke Skywalker is with Lor San Tekka. Dell is then executed by former Imperial officer Agent Gideon Hask, who has joined the First Order. <laughs> in that 30-year time gap, Versio also has a daughter named Zay. It's in this 30-year time gap that Mason Carr and a number of other Star Wars fans want more stories. The petition has currently been signed by 636 people. Do you plan on signing the petition? Do you want to see more stories about Versio and Dell following the Battle of Jakku and before the events of The Force Awakens? Da, 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 da. Uh, I, for one, wouldn't mind seeing that. I'm all for more Star Wars lore and for more... Uh, uh, a fan interaction, especially when it comes to what we've been having to deal with recently uh, with the movies and everything like that. And quite frankly, I'm not going to get into the whole uh, spiel about what I think about the movies and yada, yada, yada. Go check out The Mandalorian, though. It's really, really cool. Anyway, I'm going to go ahead and leave the link to the petition in the, in the description just in case you want to go sign in, just in case you're into this stuff. I'm going to because I'm super into this. So... Uh, if you like the video, go ahead and leave a thumbs up, a comment, and most of, importantly, go sub to the channel. It helps me out immensely, and turn on notifications for whenever I upload videos as well, if you like this content, that is. If you don't, then, well, I don't know what to do with you. So, anyway, you take care, everyone. Ta-ta.